was a tough story for me to read. I just want you to know that the one. The one about the vagina? No. <laughs> what do you want to call it? <laughs> I don't want to call the, it at all. The coochie okay? coo is that better? Just <laughs> say what it is. It's just biology. It just coochie coo originally referred to a type of dance where the women would sort of manipulate their their bellies, belly dance in a suggestive manner. And uh, since then, it has come to become associated with uh, vagina or a woman's sexual organs. So there's a uh, song called Rock and Roll Coochie Coo. And most people are not really aware of that, but that's kind of part of the uh, meaning of the lyrics. It can also be used as a verb, so someone can uh, do coochie coo with uh, some woman, which means to have sex with her. Uh, coochie coo can also be shortened to coochie. Uh, I met this uh, real cute girl the other day, and uh, I just want to go rock and roll coochie coo with her anytime she's ready. Nowadays, a lot of women, they shave down below. They want their coochie coos to look as pretty as possible. So, have won. So, um, we yes! think the winner was... Yes! Yes! I think... I just want to shit load of money! Oh, so we're going to have to go into the Shitload refers to something in large amounts. It's similar to the idea of a boatload or a truckload. And typically shitload would refer to money or work. So I can say I earned a shitload of money last week or I, er or I have a shitload of work to do, which means a lot of work. During the financial crisis, uh, the government uh, loaned the banks a shitload of money. But nonetheless, the banks were able to pay it back within several years. My friend, he's been working on Wall Street the last 10 years, and he makes a shitload of money year in, year out. He's got this huge house, great car, and a country club, beautiful wife and kids. That's what a shitload of money will do for you. I went to a garage sale the other day hoping to find something interesting, but all I saw were a shitload of old clothes and broken, beat down stuff, so I ended up walking out without buying anything. That's all for today. Tom Taylor is an ESL tutor. He teaches English in the United States and outside, all over the world using Skype. He can be reached at his website, which is esl-fullsteamahead.com Click on this link and check out his website and email with questions. Thank you, Tom, and I'll talk to you next time. Thank you.